All right, so if you're out there and you're gonna go buy a 7.3 IDI, you probably asked yourself, what are some problems I'm gonna come across? Some of the big problems you're gonna come across is air intrusion is the biggest one. You see on these IDIs, these little plastic caps on each injector, uh, they'll have these little rubber O-rings underneath and they'll dry up and then they'll let air into the system and it can cause long start times, hard starts, or no starts even. The best way to fix that air intrusion is these R&D billet aluminum rails. A little bit of a pain to install, but I'll tell you, them plastic caps just blow them out of the water. Another problem you're gonna have is uh, these visors up here, if they're not put in professionally, and they tend to rust a lot, and so you can have a leaky cab. If these trucks aren't properly washed all the time, the front quarter panels will tend to rust up in the front where the salt, um, I don't know how to like phrase that better. I don't know. Another problem you're gonna have sometimes is fuel tank issues. Sometimes your fuel gauge isn't gonna read anything or you'll get to a quarter tank and the truck will die. And there's a little shower head in the tank and it just falls off, which drops your pickup tube by about, I think it's a half inch or better and you just can't suck up any more fuel. So if you're towing heavy, like over 15,000 pounds, you're gonna find that your radiator is gonna have a hard time with that much weight. So you're gonna wanna go nice and slow. Every time you change the oil, make sure you get a new drain plug gasket because they're notorious to leak, even the oversized ones. So put, take your time putting them on. Yeah. So I haven't found too many things wrong with these things to be honest, so maybe you have. Add it in the comments. And that's it for this video today. So if you liked it, give her a like. If you really enjoyed it, subscribe to the channel, that'd be great. And if not, I hope you enjoy.